About 300 people here in Northeast Wisconsin paid their final respects and celebrated the life of Packers legend Fred Thurston at Lambeau Field today. Of course, his teammates and fans knew him as Fuzzy, a nickname he'd had since a child. Thurston died this week after battles, first with cancer, then with Alzheimer's. Fox 11's Bill Miston was at Lambeau Field for the service that celebrated what his on-field partner all those years called Fuzz's Wonderful World. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Former Packers guard Jerry Kramer says he and Frederick Thurston it's, uh, impossible were more than just teammates. Explain the relationship we have with a guy for 55 years. But what that relationship was. Family, your brother, your, your pal, your confidant, your so many different things, so many different moments. Moments. He was just that type of guy. Where he would pick he you up. the one that if you were... Even when he had a bad day in practice, Fuzzy would say something to pick you up. Or come close to literally picking you up. Remember the first time I met him, I went to shake his hand and he hugged me. And I, I think he did that with everybody. We never shook hands. We were huggers. The Altoona, Wisconsin native with six NFL championships was far more than just a Lombardi-era left guard leading the power sweep offense. I thought he could have been an opera singer. He had a great singing voice. He was a singer as well as a father, grandfather, but best known as very special Packer. Packers president Mark Murphy says Fuzzy personified the player fan connection. His radiance attracted so many fans to him. In fact, many fans identified with the Packers through Fuzzy. That continues today. Fuzzy had a heart of gold. I will tell you what, he would give anything to help people. And yeah, it's tough because we lost the legend. And he's a good man. Just miss him. And the stories about him. Yeah, love the Green Bay Packer fans, so we wanted to include them in this celebration of his life. Fuzzy's daughter Tori admits everyone seems to have a fuzzy story. A lot of people felt they knew him personally because he took the time to, you know, actually sit down and talk to them about things. And a lot of stories today, a lot of reminiscing, and it's just what my dad would have wanted. Fuzz, we all love you. We're all going to miss you. I just can't wait to see you again, Fuzz. I did it. In Green Bay, Bill Miston, Fox 11 News. Now, all those services have been held before in the Lambeau Field Atrium area to celebrate someone's life. It's the first time such an event has been held for a former Packers player. If you'd like to see more of today's service for one of the all-time most popular Packers, we have a photo gallery online.